Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the Fun Fair vlogs. We are in St Andrews for the main event, the main reason why we came to Scotland on this occasion. And it's a street fair, can you believe it? It's the first Scottish street fair that I've been to. But we're excited to see what is here and bring it all to the channel, show you what is here on a tour and take you on some rides as well. But before we do that, make sure you are subscribed to this channel, completely free to do so. And make sure you're following us on our social media platforms, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, TikTok, and Threads. I'm stood by um, a coffee thing. I'm just making sure that there's no door there and the door, it won't be the first time that's happened where I stood in a doorway and got hit by a door. It won't open. I am joined, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> I am joined by the green machine himself, Theo. Hello. Theo, we've had a little walk around. And we've you... not even finished the whole place yet. Yeah, we haven't fully walked around. Yeah. However, um, not many new rides. There is a few new rides and a few familiar rides from our area. Anything that you've been eyeing up? Yeah. What's this dance? Killing Mbappe. What? Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. Of course, uh, mostly Scottish machines here. There is a few from uh, England, uh, as you see, as we will take you around. But there's most of the rides that we were here, we've done before. But there is a couple of new ones. And some and of them <laughs> that I've not done in a while, and I can't wait to do them. What? And it, and it might take an hour. If take you want to skip it, skip it. It's not going to take an hour to do the tour. We're not that slow. Shall we start the tour here and work round, yeah? yeah? Or shall we, tell you what, we'll walk and talk, we'll start. It's in two parts. This is in two parts. So this is one side of it, which is, this. it's a four day fair, five day fair. This has already been on for a few days. And then there's a, an additional road uh, with more big rides on. So we'll show you this section first, which has been here the longest. And then the two day event on top of it, is on the next road over there. This is the only bit I've not walked down, so I've not seen these rides yet, and I've just spotted a small fun house. We'll take you for that tour now, as we I nearly to the end. Five. Oh, here we go. Can I just say, everywhere around Fife reminds me of Yorkshire. Everything screams Yorkshire. And this gives me a little bit of Harrogate and York feeling. If you've been to York and Harrogate, you may understand what I mean. And some of the seaside towns look like Scarborough and Bridlington. It's basically Scotland's answer to the east coast of Yorkshire. Right, let's take you for a tour. We'll start here and we'll show you everything that is here. Start with these planes here. We've got some planes for the juveniles, the kids. I'm just going to check. I don't think anything else is down here. I don't... Imagine coming all this way and missing a strip. I have to check these things, you see. Uh, no. <laughs> it starts here. I'm just checking I've not missed anything. You know what these street fairs are like. We've been there. Some street fairs are all over the place and you're like, you can easily miss things. There is a fun house here. This fun house looks uh, very oh, well, small. Where it goes down into a tent. Yeah, yeah we'll, we'll get to that. A very small fun house. So that means we're not doing it loads of... Uh... Yeah, I know. Uh, so, yeah. It went down a side into a tent. Yeah, I know. That's sharp too. What, what are you on about? Then when I, we found this fun house, went down into just a sharp turn. Okay, where was that? The bar. <laughs> cool story, bro. Uh, game stall here. Crossbow game. Some water walkers. I've seen quite a few of these recently. You don't see these very often. These are like the original juveniles, ladybugs. More um, game stores. Some up to date cranes here. Prime squishies. Yeah, no. <laughs> Should have shown him. Should have shown him that. We have got a little wheel there. We've got a mini Miami over here. I've yeah, shown you all them already. Are you priming up? Yeah, whatever. Uh, we have a Miami. I believe there's two Miamis, and both Miamis are Lapar. I don't know who's the are, but maybe Johnson. Not sure. Oh, Theo's tall enough. I'm tall enough for those. Nice one. Uh, I was told there's no repeat rides here on the main side apart from the Miami. So everything you see, there's only one of. So there is only one waltzer. And we've done it before. It's Cadona Star Chaser. Now, I'll be totally honest. I've had mixed rides on this. I've had some really, really good rides. And then I've had some standard ones. 
so I'm hoping it's performing. We'll see, because we will be doing it. It came to Blackburn a few years ago, and it ran so well. And we've also done it at KLM a few times. So when we did it two years ago at KLM, it was on four. It does go to KLM, you're right. One of the four that goes there. Of course when it is. Do, I think when we go to the fair, we went past the KLM thing, didn't we? We did, we did. That's right, I'll, I'll make mention that in a moment. Of course it is a four hill. <laughs> Most Scottish water. Uh, yeah, we've just been going to a few different grounds. We went to one not far from here. I can't pronounce it. And they had a flat back there. Um, we've been touring Fife. Um, and we went through Kakodi, didn't we? Went through Kakodi. And obviously, I've never seen Kakodi or Kakaldi um, as it is without the rides. So to a lot of people, that's normal. But when you see it, I've only ever seen it as KLM. It looks so weird. This came from Burnt Island. We did go to Burnt Island. There is a vlog from there if you want to check that out from this year and last year. This was there, but it left by the time we got there this year. Uh, and it is here this time. Just seeing how high it goes. Yeah, about right. There's, there's been quite a few paratroopers uh, that I've seen recently that have not been going very high. That looks decent. I think we've done, I think we've done this, but I don't know where. There's a few different paratroopers we've seen and done uh, last year, wasn't there, up in Scotland? Wait, what if there's a paratrooper? Well, I think I know what paratrooper is. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> I thought it was what my was thinking. Theo thinks he knows everything. But, to be honest with you, Theo knows quite a lot and he usually remembers stuff. So when I ask him, he knows more than I do. Because then what happens is, I see all these rides, I forget who they are, what they look like, and if I've done them or seen them before. I think we've done, I think, I think we've done it before. Don't quote me. If someone will know, someone please put it in the comments. Make me happy. We're just going to walk down the other side. I'm not going to go all the way down. Um, down here, there's quite a few just stalls down here. There is like a market store here. So I, I'm assuming they have market days here as well. Um, food stalls slushies and more market stalls uh, all down there and even a boots good to know in it we'll walk back down and then we'll go on to the other side where all the main rides are which is the exciting bit all in the barracks so i love about street fairs and you'll see this on the next road um there's loads of trees down there so you'll see how um how how tight it is Oh yeah, that is a Christmas shot. Well, it's not even Christmas. Merry Christmas, everyone. Well, it's Christmas in 10 years. 10 years, okay. <laughs> uh, we've got an inflatable. Uh, we have got a caterpillar ride that's got an um, big apple. I think I've seen this. The, oh, I can't remember how it goes now. I think the balls stay in place and you can sort of head of the balls as you go around. I'll just show you down here, what's down here, loads of little things here, like these, Bam and Sam. We've got L and B's mini wheel. Go this way. It's always roller coaster last night. With, um, that was in Leaven, but absolutely threw it down. Little chair planes, little seater. There's the paratrooper again, that's how we've just dipped around. That's still the same cycle, by the way. Looks like they're giving you a good ride on that. Why do I feel like that was the one that we did last year? No, it can't have been. I was going to say um, Androzan, but I don't think it was that one. Because we went to Burnt Island at the same time and it would have been there. Giving good cycles by the looks of it. And then we're back in the the center. I have noticed a lot of waltzers and I, I do think this is the right thing to do. Lots of waltzers are getting cash boxes on the outside like they have here. I don't remember them having one. They might have had it, uh, but I think more and more waltzers are getting cash boxes on the outside. And you've got to get a token before you go in the ride queue. I do believe that is better in my opinion anyway. This is like the link between the two. Cake shop. I'm not hungry, I've had breakfast. A little, uh, another teacup set here. 
juveniles will repeat themselves, but the main rides, apart from the Miami, don't. Helter Skelter. Or what they call slide. Uh, trampoline bungees. He's only got half of it because he can't fit all the way down. A little uh, penalty shootout. I think that's the one where you knock. If you hit its head, it falls over. Theo might be good at that actually. Yeah. You gotta knock two down though. We're gonna go this way first. I'll tell you what, what we'll do is we'll walk down there and then we'll walk all the way down to that other side. So Theo, give me your hand. Keep it straight. Ready? And as if by magic, we're at the other side of the fair, aren't we? Magic, yes. isn't it? Magic. Yes. Magic of editing. What do you mean, no? I'll tell you how we did it. No, you don't need to. We'll come to one side of the main strip. This is only on for two days, this side, uh, or this, this road itself. Now, we saw this literally yesterday. This was at South Queen's Ferry yesterday. They pulled it down that afternoon and brought it here that evening for ready for today. We didn't film there, it's a bit of a shame. We were gonna film there, but because of the weather, it literally threw it down. The and the tagger didn't open. Yeah, the tagger didn't open. But we did we did go on the extreme, which was Taylor's uh, Techno Power. So Theo has done it, I have filmed it. I don't know if I'll release it or what I do with that footage, but we have filmed it. It's quite, I think it might be quite funny because view is a bit like, whoa, this is crazy, weren't you? Yeah. <laughs> Carrying on with the tour, walk all the way down to the other side. We've got some balloons here. Another penalty shooter. Prize every time. I like things like that. Score 150. Score 150 and you get 25 pounds. That means you've got a score. Centre top. Four times. No, three times. Yeah, you got no chance. You might think you you might think you're this footballer, but every time you've been playing, you, you won once, didn't you? You did it at Crew. Do you remember? No, not Crew. Sandbatch. Yeah, I got it in the middle top. And do you remember when I got the hoop? I got the hoop player. That was good, that wasn't it? Yeah, a little toy set here. Right next to there is a very very unique ride from Wheatley's Party Crew. This is Speed Buzz. There's a few novelty rides in the UK that are absolutely amazing. This is one of them. It's the only one in the UK. This is a KMG Fun Factory. I just wish more people would, would take them. I don't know what the reliability's like, which is why I don't think they're that common. It's a great ride. We've done it a few times and there's a video on our Facebook of the on-ride. Let's try. So we yeah, Speed Buzz is great. We have got um, a simulator. Now, again, we saw this yesterday in Leven uh, with the roller coaster. Uh, that was there last night. We went there and it absolutely threw it down as well. So we weren't planning on filming there anyway, but we did see that last night. We've got a meteor roundup. I'm on the right, it's called it. Yeah, Meteor Right it's called. Never seen this before. Don't know what it's capable of. Which gives me anxiety. I'm not too sure if Theo wants to go on this or not. Yeah, I will. Oh. I'll, I'll think about that one. Bungees, trampolines. There is an arcade here. I think this is the only one here from what I saw. I believe this was at Burnt Island. I think we've seen this at KLM as well. Yeah, I think this was at KLM this year, actually. Gold dust. Pull the max grabs. Jumping star or jumping jack. We have got another fun house. However, this is not any old fun house. This is probably the best fun house in the UK. This is Ace Puller's Crazy Circus Fun House. 
and we are 100% going on this. And you know about me saying about fun houses and how I prefer not to do them. This one is getting done because it is absolutely amazing. Every time we see this, we're going on it. Yeah, we do. We don't see this very often at all. It's very, very rare to see this it's really for us. It is a Hull Fair, yeah, it does go to Hull. So we'll be going on that later today. That is for sure. Absolutely love that thing. And uh, yeah, we'll, we'll definitely be seeing it again in a few months time as it goes to uh, Hull Fair. But we'll be taking advantage of doing that whilst we're in Scotland. There is a ghost train. I've not seen this one before. This is, oh, I might have seen this before. Road to hell, it seems to ring a bell, this. The cars look quite new. Those kind of cars remind me of Coral Island in Blackpool. I love these. Now they remind me of that ghost train, that three-story ghost train. Oh yeah, 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 that's true. Uh, I forgot about that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The one that was at Hunstanton, it's still there actually. I love these. Grim Reaper just going, oh yeah. The trucks. Got a slide, usually like a Disney slide. We have a tag at her. Never done this one before. And Theo is tall enough. This is pump it up. It looks so fresh. Look at that. Marshmallow man, yeah. The lights on it, the, the backflash, everything's looking very fresh. Looks like they've had a bit of work done on it as well, it's quite shiny. This is, um, is it Slater's? I wasn't too sure who's it is, maybe I have seen it before. I wouldn't recognise it though, if they've had a bit of work done on it. With a hands in the air, with a hands in the sky, with a hands in the air, come on! Shake him on it! Now, if you've seen us recently, you'll know that the uh, will tag us. Are you going to do the tag there? Yeah. Just like that. Now we have two rides very, very familiar to the channel. Toxic. This is Graham Sedwick. Obviously, he's a Scottish showman. But we do see it in, you, uh, in England quite a lot. Yes, Graham. We've done it so many times. Accompanying it, I can't speak with it. <laughs> it's Mexican wave frogs. Oh my life, he's had oh, he's done. Oh my life, he's got his top flash done. No, look at the background. What? Look at the background of it. Yeah, no. He's got like a firework display on the background of his um, top flash. Oh, lovely. Why that? Yeah, Mason goes. I'll get some photos of that after. Yeah, great, great uh, frog set this. He's from the northwest. Hopefully it does well for him. Now then, here's a ride that I've never seen before. I've seen Super Bobs, clearly, you know this. But look at this. Look at the cars! That's the bus there, you are the one that's not! Now that this is 
got me very intrigued because you know I'm not a big fan of Super Bobs. This looks very interesting. We may have to do this. Seems to be quite popular. A lot of people there watching. It looks very smooth. John Marshall. <laughs> we said hi to him before. I don't think he saw us just said, Yeah, definitely. I think we'll be going on that, won't we? Yeah. Yeah, that looks good, that. Near the end of the tour, you'll be glad to know. This is like a 25 minute tour. <laughs> I think my longest tour was hard. Where, where's my longest tour probably? Hull. Yeah. yeah. Uh, we've got a formula set there, another inflatable. Uh, there is another bungee trampoline set. Oh, these guys messaged us. Uh, the donut hut. Uh, to go and see them. Uh, they, yeah, they messaged us yesterday. So come and see us. So we'll, um, we'll go over to them after. Oh, I might pop over in a minute actually. Uh, and then to box this tour off, oh the bungee trampolines there. And to box this tour off, this is the first and last ride. This is the way we came in actually. But we parked as well for free. <laughs> we found a parking space. Someone was pulling out as we went down the road. And it's literally a three minute walk away. Jackpot. Is a twister. Now of course, I must have seen this before. Let me see whose it is. Cadonas. So this might be the one. This might have been the one that was at um, Riverside Museum. I think so. I'll have to get that checked. You know what I'm like. I like to get my information correct. I've, I've probably just shown you my password to my phone. So basically, if you've got a Google phone, I love how you do this. If you just search, hang on, I'm near, I'm near Scotland, where are we? Uh, Riverside, hope, hope I'm looking. Uh, Riverside Museum, where are you? I think it's on here somewhere. Yeah, it's definitely not Greyheads, because Greyheads had a, a purple top. Cadonas is here. Come on, come on. It is, here it is. That's Riverside Museum. That's that one, that is, yeah. We, we knew it was Cadonas, because he's wearing Cadonas on it. Uh, but we've, um, yeah, we have done this before. Uh, we, we went to Riverside Museum at Christmas when we did um, Iron, Brew, Iron Brew Carnival. And we saw their waltzer as well. So that's now up here. And that is tour complete. That is what is here at St Andrews. By the time this vlog comes out, this pair won't be here. It's only on for a few days. Last year, I was told I need to come to this. So we did. And this year, we're being told to go to, is it Narn or something? Narn, somewhere up on the, right up the north. It will take us seven hours to get to from Blackpool. What? If the Northern Lights are on, I'll be all over it. What? Um, there's a Scottish fair right up. It's um, horns. Well, I don't think it's horns, but hot, a lot, all their stuff's there. Uh, it's a fair really far away from here. It's another three hours from here, I think, actually. In, in Scotland, yeah. Right to the top of the... I nearly said the world then. Right to the top of the UK. You know where Scotland is, but really high up. Yeah. Right, I think we need to be tactical here and go down the line. Can we do the Super Bob first? No. Why? I want to do Tagada. You want to do the Tagada? Right, okay. And then can we come and do the Super Bob? Maybe. What do you mean maybe? You chose the first prize, I'll choose the next one, yeah? Maybe! Oh, okay. I'm choosing all! This, this kid gets harder to work with. Alright, first ride then. You're going to experience Theo on a totally different Tagada. Will he come off liking it? Will he come off loving it? Put your votes in, please. Let's find out. I'm going back on. Yeah, alright. 
Ja, nu ser vi her. Do you know what you've let you do you know what you let yourself in for? What? You don't know do you? He's on a tag of there again. <laughs> this could go either way. Love it or hate it. Here we go.
should have uh, done it again. How was it?
influence. And with the added extra of holding onto the side. Brilliant. Thank you for riding journeys again soon. Come on, pay now for the next ride. That was truly really good. Really good. Smooth. Can I just point out? Size of them wheels. Wheels are really but big. And you know what? That's probably what makes it smoother. Brilliant by that. That's um Sweeney's brother, he said to me. The guy that uh, was at the uh, Leicester Fair on the ghost train. Brilliant. Like that. I just like how it's like it's never been well apart from the LED, it's never been brought up to date. No. Well it has. But it's still got that old school feel to it and I like that. Those cars never change them cars. Brilliant super bob. Here's a bit of Mexican wave. One of the best frogs in the UK is here today. Also featured at the KLM earlier this year. Featured at some big rounds with us as well. Only the best. Look at that top sign. I'll try and get it one time.
songs that I hear. Typically. A big fair is like this. The three fairs, he doesn't run them that long. Well, we're getting a good fair share today. So you can't. So it, it's an illusion. 
great. How close did we get? Really? I've got to tell us. I told you to stretch your legs. I know, I tried, but well, I, I, I didn't want to. Um, based on your fingers, by doing that, how close do you reckon we got to that? that, that? I mean, you got a little hand, so yeah. <laughs> It's one of the only fun houses I can think of off the top of my head that I will happily say I'm going on without even getting Theo to tell me I'm going on it. Love it. And it is the crazy circus. We don't get to do this very often. We did it, I think, the first time we ever did it, first time we ever did it was Hartlepool, no. Um, sorry, it was up northeast. It wasn't Hartlepool though. Rainton Arena. I think it was four years ago. And then we do it a whole fair. And it is the the the, the sheet, as in paper. That. Is it? What do you mean? What? How would you remember that? Oh, wow. Do you know what I mean about Theo's memory? Here we go. This is the crazy circus. Seriously, you're in for a social. You're in for. Oh my god. It's you're in wacky, for a treat. It's crazy. All the fun is in the inside. Come on, don't miss it. Don't walk by. Come on, mate. You can do it. Nice and easy. This isn't it. Contact to the safety bars. Just take your time. Take your time, T. Take your time. Yeah, we need some more runners for the fun house. The step step is so easy on this, nice and slow. Nice and slow. Just one at a time, that was so slow. You just want to get to the top. What I love as well, is you go all the way up the top, and then you go back downstairs again. <laughs> well, there's so, so much more yet. The best is yet to come. Come on, jump on, it's the crazy circus fun house. Look at this. Some more riders sit this way. Join in the fun. I'm trying to get through here. <laughs> oh my god. We have no doors and trap doors. Me. All of you are missing. Don't walk by. It's the Crazy Circus Funhouse! Oh, Look really he's got! Now, you have an option. 
Go you can go. Slide, go the you can do the slide, which is just a slide to the exit. Boring. Or go down the you can do this. Go on then. What movie should we go now? Right then. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Go down, go down, go down. Right. You need to do me a favour and hold my bag. Yeah, I'll drop don't, it down. Yeah, after. Wait until I've gone. And do, don't down. push me. <laughs> this is a very steep one. You don't touch me. I'm warning you. I'm warning you. Right. <laughs> Push me! <laughs> right, I'll turn the camera around. Stop pushing me. Three, two, no, I'm not ready! <laughs> This fun house has two slides, but you go down one of them. It has a big conveyor belt yeah, and it has a little conveyor belt. You go round step, step twice, the conveyor the belt. Conveyor it's got so much going on, I can't explain everything. Yeah, Theo, that's my favourite. A rating out of 10, what do you give it? Infinite. Infinite out of 10. You know what, you can't really score it, it's just so amazing. Brilliant ride. Right, moving on as we head down the main strip. We're going to do the meteor ride through request of Theo. Um, I'm just looking at this and it looks a little bit fast. Is it me? Or do the ones that go clockwise go faster? Because the one in Mablethorpe went clockwise, but Nathan Jones's goes anti-clockwise. It doesn't go all the way up though. Yeah, I'm not sure about this. Can I can I skip this? What? Can I can I skip it? Oh, here we go.
them two Muppets screaming. We've got earache as well. That was a tough ride to do, I'll be honest. That was tough. That was tough to do. It wasn't as fast as uh, the one I've done before. It, although it felt like it was going to be. But it was faster than I'm used to. Using my hoodie to rest my head back actually paid off for me. It's a simulator. You've been on one before. Yeah, but I don't know what it is. Oh. It's, a, it's a ghost train. No. Right, coming up next is this absolute crazy machine called Speed Buzz. This has got potential to be ride of the day here. Somebody scream! Let's see. Push him up high, come on! We've, um, we've not started yet, but I put in a special request. And that special request is a speed bus song. Guess what's on? Speed bus song. It's a be speed bus song. Look also who it is. It's Johnny. <laughs> He's uh, of um, how do you pronounce? Is it Ecos? Ecos. 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 That was a terrible accent. You can follow him, him on um, Facebook. He does a lot of photography. A lot of photography of Scotland. We've got these as well. Hey! Give us a wave! That was terrible! Not featuring you guys again. Right, here we go. This is Speed Buzz. Let's go, let's go, Speed Buzz crew! Hands in the air! a little bit Whoa. Right, here we go <laughs> I love this song Right, here we go. Now we've got the motion. Let's hope this keeps going. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Hey, hey, hey! Come on, right, come on the inside, come on the inside. This song. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> I really need to know the lyrics to the song. <laughs> oh, it's insane this ride. Okay, if you want to go faster, let me see your hands up high to get them in the sky. Come on. Let's go fast speed! in this ride you can't get the spin like a waltzer isn't it really oh here we go we're off again Ooh. 
Fantastic ride. Yeah, the best ride, one of the best rides in the UK is this. And it's all the way in Scotland normally. It did go to Hall in 2019 as a floater. It hasn't been back since. I hope it gets a chance to go to one of the big English fairs again. There's a few of them. KLM is the biggest it does, realistically. have one more ride to do and it's no less than the waltzer saving the best till last i'd like to say but it's got a lot to beat speed buzz i have to say this is cadona's um star chaser i'm really looking forward to doing this and i really hope it is running how i've seen it in the past let's see it's final ride I've got a very important question. Have we saved the best till last? Yeah. Theo seems to think so. And so do the guys off in it as well. <laughs> uh, they have informed me that they're not able to mic, so uh, bear that in mind. But obviously, micing makes it a whole lot different. This goes flat out. Tell you what, they've got plenty of spinners on here.
missed that one. better than how we had it in KLM as well so <laughs> it was really good that um Theo um, any rating you want to give that or anything no no I feel sick <laughs> do you know what all the rides here have been running really well and when I choose ride of the day it's actually going to be quite difficult to choose but that does end the vlog here in St Andrews I want to say thank you to everyone that suggested coming here because quite a lot of you have said to come here and you know what, it's been really good. There's some unique rides here. Some we've done before, some we've not done before. And I know we've had a lot of suggestions for another get a ground for this year, but we can't make it this year. So we've got a few suggestions for next year. So we may fulfill them, we'll see. Uh, they are quite distant, so we'll see. Um, we're hoping to be back in Scotland at Christmas time. Uh, we want to do Edinburgh this year for Edinburgh markets, especially for tailors. So I do want to try and get that to this year. Uh, I don't know if we're going to do Iron Brew this year. We'll have to see what the lineup is because no one knows what the lineup is at all. So we'll see how that is and we'll see what else comes on as well. But we'll definitely be back in Scotland. So I hope you've enjoyed our presence up here. And thank you for everyone that's been supportive of our channel in Scotland because it, it, it astounds me how many supporters we have up here. It's crazy. So thank you to all you guys. Also, thank you to all the uh, showmen up in the north, up in Scotland as well for the accommodation up here as well. It's been really well received. Thank you so much. Uh, Theo, how was your time in St Andrews? Good. Do you like street fairs? Do you think they're different? Yeah, I like them too. Do you have a favourite ride of this ground? Tagada. Tagada? Why? Okay. Okay, just because, yeah. A few hot rides here. The Super Bob on form. Mexican Wave on form. Uh, Tagada was, was quite good. Uh, Toxic, the Fun House, uh, Ace of Pullers Fun House, um, Speed Buzz, Meteor Ride was a little bit fast for me, unfortunately, but it wasn't too bad. Uh, and of course, this was on point as well. If I have to choose Ride of the Day, it's very close between Speed Buzz, this, and the Super Bob. Speed Buzz will probably take it away because the Speed Buzz is absolutely amazing. It actually wipes the floor to a lot of waltzes that we have in the UK. In fact, it probably is better than any waltzer. And I know we shouldn't compare to a waltzer, but the experience is similar in a way, uh, but not quite the same. Some of you will know what I'm talking about. And it's hard to come by because it's based in Scotland. It's Wheatley's. Wheatley's is a Scottish showman. Does come to England a few times. I hope to see it at a big round later this year because I love it. We will get to see Ace of Pullers Funhouse at Hull. Well, hopefully, it usually goes there. Um, and of course, we'll see Toxic and Mexican Wave in the next few months anyway. Um, 
and then I think that's it really. I, I, when we come to Scotland, I want to try and catch some new rides, new grounds, new showmen, and of course new waltzers, please. So if you have any suggestions for waltzers up in Scotland, please do let me know because we have ticked a few off this week end or week uh, already. Um, when I say a few, yeah, uh, it's, it's just one. <laughs> Um, but yeah, let me know. Obviously, we're going to try and catch Taylor's at Christmas, uh, which is the Edinburgh one. Um, there's quite a few up here that we've not done, so hopefully we do catch them next year. If you've got any suggestions, please let me know. Uh, but yeah, Scotland 2023 summer version complete once again. I hope you've enjoyed this. Make sure you are subscribed to the channel. Completely free to do so. Follow us on our social media platforms, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, TikTok and Threads. Please do definitely follow us on Facebook. We do produce more content on there as well, including videos. So do, do check them out. Oh, right. Have you had a good time in Scotland? Yeah. What, do you want to say thank you to everyone for uh, watching? No. <laughs> Why? I'll say it for you. Thank you for watching. Um, that's it. Is that it? Have I said everything? Yeah. No, no. Like and subscribe. What? Tell them to like and subscribe. I have done, but I haven't said like. Make sure you do like the video, leave a comment. And we'll see you in the next vlog. We'll show you a bit of slow-mo of the Star Chaser. Take care, guys. Goodbye from me. Bye. Tap it out.